Hey guys, it's Catherine. Welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be taking you guys through my night routine. So it's 9.36 right now. I meant to start this before I went to the gym. I'll usually go to the gym around like 7.30, 8-ish at night and depending on how long my workout is, depending on like what I work out that day. Some days it's like a 30 minute workout, some days it turns into, what was that, like <laughs> well over an hour. I feel like I got a really good workout in today though. I always use my Apple Watch to track my workout. So let's see what the stats were from today. So usually when I track my workouts at the gym, I will usually select the hit section one that they have on the Apple Watch. That way I don't have to like constantly keep switching between like the elliptical or the stairs or the treadmill and like strength training. I just set it to one and like record it the whole time. Total, it was an hour and 41 minutes and that also included stretching stuff like that and the total calories was 869 the total active calories was 748 so that's like a typical <laughs> typical night workout for me i'm home now i'm gonna make myself some eggs i usually don't eat too much after a workout but i'm feeling pretty hungry today so i'm gonna make myself an egg and some toast and that's gonna be like a quick little post-workout meal for me I always love adding a little bit of this on top. All right, my egg is done. I feel like this looks so sad, but this is my dinner for tonight. We're just going with it. All right, so now that I've finished dinner and I'm back upstairs, this is when I usually like to light some candles, you know, like get in a cozy, a cozy vibe, cozy mood. And some clothes that were laying out, so I'm gonna fold those up, put those away. Plug my laptop in because I'm done with work for tonight and I'll light some candles. This one is the Blue Volcano candle from Anthropology, And then this is my other favorite one to light. This one is Tobacco and Cedar. And this one is from TJ Maxx. All right, now we've got candles burning. And I need to hop in the shower to wash off my makeup. I normally don't go to the gym with makeup on, but I filmed three videos today, so I kind of had to have makeup for that. And then I did not take it off before I went to the gym. I'm gonna hop in the shower and I usually do a face mask after, so I'll show you guys that in a sec. All your life you've tried to be a good man inside, did everything that you thought you should. Didn't seem to do you any good. Now that we are post shower looking real cute, my hair like half got wet in the shower. <laughs> um, I just got my hair done probably like two, three days ago and it's still pretty clean so didn't wash it. But anyways, I'll give you guys a quick little rundown on my uh, super quick, super current skincare routine. I always start off with some micellar water. This is the Garnier All Skin Types Even Sensitive Pink version that they have. And then after that, I usually go in with the Thayer's Witch Hazel. This bottle is like disgustingly dirty from an eyeshadow palette that's spilled in my makeup bag months ago and that happened to be in there. So that's nice and dirty now too. So I am gonna do that really quick. Okay, well, you guys can still see me through this mirror even though it's not as clear. We'll just, we'll just go off of that. So I always start out with the micellar water and I'm just gonna put some of that on here. I did wash my face with like a very gentle um, face cleanser in the shower just to wash off like most of my makeup. 
so then I usually just go in with this and basically try to get off whatever did not come off in the shower. And then I go in with the witch hazel and put a little bit of that on a cotton pad and basically just get everything else off of my face. Okay, so once that is done, you guys can kind of tell that I have like all of my face products and like go-to's laid out for everyday use because it's honestly so much easier. So lately at night, I've been going in with this. This is by Volition. It's their Strawberry Sea Serum and I believe they were supposed to be starting to sell this at, I want to say Sephora. So I think you guys can check there for that. So I always use this. And then lately after the serum, I've been going in with this product by Drunk Elephant. This is their polypeptide cream. And this was actually part of like their little birthday, birthday gift thing that you could choose for the month. So I picked this up. Sometimes I will also go in with this. This is the Dr. Brandt No More, can't talk, Dr. Brandt No More Baggage. Um, I had a puffin gel, but I used this this morning, so I usually just use it like once a day when it's needed. So I'm just gonna go in with this. I love the little like squeeze top. And then I'll usually do like a pea size amount. That's really honestly all that you need. And then I put it into my hands and just kind of press it into my face. All right, and then once that is dry, I'm gonna go in with the little polypeptides and put a little bit of that on and just kind of rub it in. So that is pretty much it when it comes to a skincare I don't usually self tan my face, so as you guys can tell, there's like quite a difference between my self tanned body and my face. <laughs> um, my hair is also crazy from the gym, so we're just gonna try to let that like, you know, find its place again. Um, so now that we've got all the skincare done and set, I'm gonna head back downstairs and if you guys know anything about me, you know that I love my wine. And we're gonna head downstairs and grab ourselves a glass of wine. Okay, let's see. What wine glass do we have tonight? We will just go with this one. I think all of my favorite wine glasses are pretty dirty right now, so this is what we got to work with. And then for our wine selection tonight, I just have the Cote de Rosis. You know, my favorite rose. Well, I can't do this one handed. There we go. <laughs> so, we are just gonna have some rose. Now that it's summertime, I've been loving rose. Honestly, it's the best. All right. I also love the cap on this thing. Like, how convenient is that? Right? And the design on the bottom is a rose, so it's adorable. All right, we've got my wine. We've got my water bottle left over. I also have a little bit of this left over. Whoops, I did not finish anything today. And I need to put my laptop back. And I should probably charge it. Oh no, I almost lost the little charger. My favorite time of the night, turning on Netflix. Okay, let's see what we're watching. Yep, we are gonna continue watching Vampire Diaries. I have restarted it for the first time in like forever. So we're gonna watch this and sip on some rosé. All right, so usually after I've been watching Netflix for a little while lately, I have been loving reading one of the poetry books that I picked up. These are literally all of them. I'm gonna do a whole video talking about like each of them and like which ones I like the most. Uh, but I think for tonight, I am going to go through 2 a.m. Thoughts by Kenzie Campbell and just kind of read through some random ones in there and probably just going to read until I'm real tired, take out my contacts, brush my teeth, and then hop into bed. So that is pretty much it for my night routine on a typical Monday night. I'm going to get to reading this. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and make sure you guys are subscribed. I put out new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So with that being said, I'll catch you guys in my next video.